Starting with MuleApp 9, MuleApp comes in two versions, the standalone app and the plugin version. The app version is a standalone DAW and the plugin version is to be used within another DAW. Both MuleApp app and MuleApp plugin can be a synth, a sampler, an effect, it can be your own modeler sound generator or processor, a composer or any hybrid combination of these. Both MuleApp app and MuleApp plugin use the same project file format. So a project made with MuleApp app can be opened by MuleApp plugin and also the other way around. Also sounds and effects saved within MuleApp app can be opened in MuleApp plugin and also the other way around. So the choice to use MuleApp app or MuleApp plugin depends on the way you like to make music and on the way you want to produce and post-produce your music. For example, you can use MuleApp app to create musical IDs, clips and patterns and use MuleApp plugin to open those musical projects within another DAW and cooperate with someone and continue on the music you made with MuleApp app. Another example where MuleApp plugin is beneficial is when you have made music with MuleApp app and you want to add a video track onto it. So you can make music in MuleApp app, then switch to a video editor and plug in your MuleApp project and add a video track in the video software. MuleApp app and MuleApp plugin are basically the same, just some small differences specific to the app or plugin version. But MuleApp app and MuleApp plugin are 99% the same and interchangeable, which makes it very flexible.